hello guys it's real one and welcome to my channel as we are both starting this whatsapp marketing beginners course together this is actually the very first section of the course where i'll be showing you exactly how to extract whatsapp group contacts in bulk and save it on your phone well i am going to divide the video into two parts the very first part is going to be how you extract the group contacts and the second part is going to be how you're going to save the contacts in bulk into your phone then we'll have another part where you'll be opportunity to send bulk message to those contacts so to cut it short let's jump straight into the first session of the training where i'll show you how to extract whatsapp group contacts and the tools you need is just two apps the very first app is the universal copy and the second one is the droid edit app. You can go over to play store to get the boot of this app but I am going to tell you that the universal copy app is not free on the play store. You can check it out. It's not free. It's actually a paid app on the play store. So uh, when you're getting the pro version, you're going to pay some certain amounts. But I have unlocked. Just go into the uh, video description below. Droid edit app. You can go through the link as well. In my video description, you see it right there. And you download your droid edit app as well from my Google Drive. Or you can actually go to play store to download it's all your choice all right once you get the two apps installed on your phone then you want to open up your universal copy app and activate it skip all this install surface that is the accessibility function you want to click on activate and you want to click on open settings to see a list of the list of the apps that needs access to your you know your accessibility you find universal copy as one of them which is this all right just click on it and you want to turn it on up here use universal copy then you turn it on so your phone might pop up this uh, notification then just blah 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 don't mind about that just wait for this time to finish and then you click ok and that is that about that once you turn on the accessibility function for your universal copy app then you'll be opportune to make use of it and then you want to go back to the app and you can see it's done right below here then you click next 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 hit the next button down here next next and then done if there's anything you don't understand in this video after i show you how i use it you can just go over to their own private tutorial and you learn how to use the app right but i'm going to try as much as possible to show you how i've been using this app effectively so there are some settings that you will have to do upon opening this app all right you have to do some uh, important settings the very first one is this scanner mode you have to turn it on all right you want the app to launch this scanner mode immediately it is launched all right so this app has two modes it has the normal mode and the scanner mode so just turn this on so it's going to scan any text that it came across on your phone screen it's going to scan it so that is why we turn on the scanner mode and it's going to convert it to text actually scroll down you're going to see a particular place where you say select all text areas by default all right click on it and you want to select yes and you can check out some more options so you should launch the app in full screen mode as well turn this on and once you're done with all that you've successfully done setting up uh, your universal copy app you can see this is the premium version universal copy plus subscription so your plus subscription is active so you are using the pro version of that app right now to assure you that this app is really functioning right now after all those settings just scroll down your navigation i mean your notification bar all right scroll down and you see up here that universal copy is now active so it's now left to you to determine exactly what mode you want to use maybe the scanner mode or the normal mode once you click any of the two then the app is going to launch that mode for you now the next thing is using your universal app to extract whatsapp group contacts now i am going to extract contacts inside a group i'm actually not the admin of the group but i am going to extract all the list of the contacts inside the group we are having 115 participants in this group this is what you do scroll down and make sure you click on the view all right click view all so that all the contacts in that group is going to pop up for you and now the next thing you want to do is launch your universal copy using the scanner mode scroll down your notification bar and click on the scanner mode and you want to click on start now right now you can see that it has automatically selected all the text on this very page all right so you are just left with copying the text to your droid edit which we are going to talk about later so right now what you want to do next is use the scroll mode this symbol up here use it to select all the other contacts inside the group but make sure you mark the very last checkpoint all right that is the very last phone number on this list make sure you mark it but click on the scroll mode and you can see this is the last checkpoint the last phone number is this all right so just scroll up to the very last phone number and leave it so it's going to prompt you to start now and once you start once you click on start now you can see up here right now that we are now having 38 contacts selected so now you still have to scroll again scroll from the last checkpoint again this is now the last checkpoint as you can see then you scroll up again and successfully it has selected 67 contacts right now so you scroll again to the last checkpoint all right start now it's very very simple just continue this same process until you finish scanning all the phone numbers inside this group all right remember you have 115 phone numbers but it's actually it's actually going to copy their status and uh, you know the phone numbers and everything all together but now let me quickly show you how you can finalize the copying process all right after you've gotten to the very last phone number inside the group 
then you want to click up here you can see up there you see scroll mode you see 185 slash 185 that is out the amount of text the app has copied for you so far and then beside it you see something you see a very small checkbox a very small white square shape all right so you just click on it look up there you see it right there you can see so you just click on that checkbox and you want to click start now again it will pop up this things below so you want to click on copy below you can see copy so just click copy that means you've successfully copied all the 189 text that you've been able to select so far so what i want to do next is go over and make use of the drug edit app to arrange this text separate the um, alphabetic text from the phone numbers you only need the phone numbers as we've said there so and then right now you can now go over to your drug edit app and paste all Go to the website that I call phone number extractor.com. This is the website that is going to separate the phone numbers from the uh, text for you, all right? So just paste all the text into this box. You can see this box here, right? So paste the text, click on the button below to extract the phone numbers out of those texts. You're just going to go through this simple verification process. I'm now a robot, so click on it. The process is very, very simple, and now the verification is done, so you can now click on the button extract phone numbers and wait while it extracts the phone number for you. Alright, and right now you can see the phone numbers has been separated from the text successfully. So you can zoom this way, please. You can scroll now and you see the phone numbers are now out successfully. You can see the counts of the phone numbers that we are having now. This is the count. We have 110 phone numbers copied already. But remember, we have 115 contacts in that group. That means the remaining five are contacts that have been saved already on my phone. So if they are contacts that have not been saved into your phone, then you are going to have them out here. So what you want to do next is copy all the phone numbers right now. Just click down on one of them and select all. So once you select all now, you want to click on copy. So, and then right now you can now go over to your Droid Edit app and paste all the phone numbers into your Droid Edit app. So you have 110 phone numbers copied into your Droid Edit app right now and they are arranged, they are well organized and well arranged. So what you want to do is save them as text file using txt extension. Click on this very place to save them right now on your Droid Edit. So then you click on save as, you then click on local, that means you are saving them into your internal storage. Then this is the place where I want to save it into, alright, so you can select the folder of your choice where you want to save it into, but for me, I'm saving it directly into my internal storage, so you can save it at contact, at contact one, contact one dot txt, but make sure you put dot txt, it's very, very important, then you want to click on create. The next thing we're going to learn is how to actually save all these contacts in bulk, alright, so I'm going to see you in the next video where I will show you exactly how to save all the contacts you've extracted in bulk. So, but for this one time, if you are new in this YouTube channel, please kindly click on the subscribe button right now. Watching this video, if it really touches uh, one interest of you, then please kindly click on the like button below. At least with that, you can help more people to discover this video on YouTube. So, it's going to be a way to help more people as well. So, thank you very much and I'm going to see you in the next video.